Hi, welcome to this video. And in this video, I will share one of my favorite free tool. It is called Small SEO Tools. Yeah, there are so many functions that you can use for in these tools. Uh, but um, I want to talk about the uh, article um, tools. Yeah. So, for example, I have a lot of uh, writers who write for me. All right. And once they write for me, for example, like this, uh, I want to make sure that first of all, it's unique, it's original, and um, you know, it is uh, added value to my readers, right? So what I usually do after my writers send in the articles, I like to go to small SEO tools, and you can see they have this uh, plagiarism checker, uh, and they have this uh, grammar check, and I like to use um, basically these two tools, right? So let's go to plagiarism checker first, yeah? So you can take a look at, once you click on it, yeah, all you need to do is um, just copy and paste um, whatever articles that your uh, article uh, writer wrote for you, and you can just paste it here, right? So now, uh, it only checks about 1,000 uh, words. So if it's a little bit more, all you can do is just delete a little bit, or if you have like 2,000, 3,000 words, uh, you can uh, insert your articles uh, in batches, right? So all you need to do is once you enter um, your article, you just need to uh, check plagiarism. Now, if you have a website URL uh, or for it posted on your internet, uh, you can also include your URL here, right? So let's just go to check plagiarism. Just click on it. And what I usually like to see, it is at least 95% unique. Yeah, anything more or anything less than 95%, probably I will want to... How do I say this? Um, double check with my writer and uh, make sure that you know uh, he or she edits the article uh, to make sure it's unique, right? So this is what I do, yeah. So you can see that the bar is going. It is um, so far two percent plagiarized, ninety-eight mm, percent unique. So it passed, right? The next thing I like to do is double check. It is. Um, how do I say this? I like to use this um, grammar, yeah? I like to check the grammar of this article, all right? So since I know it's unique, uh, the same thing what I like to do, it is go back to S, uh, small SEO tools and choose grammar checker, all right? Oops, I accidentally clicked. Uh, Okay. All right, so here's the grammar check. Yeah, so I like to click on this. All right, same thing here. Cut and paste your article and check your grammar. And again, let it run and it will tell you what you can improve on, yeah? It's a free tool and it's quite a powerful tool that I use. So for example, like, uh, you just click this, yeah? If you have uh, uh, suggestions that you think is good, you can use it at like its own, very common, yeah? Uh, it's with apostrophe or without it's, yeah? Without apostrophe, yeah? So take a look at all suggested, yeah? You do not have to edit if you don't think that you want to, but just for you to go through uh, how it is, yeah? So, that's it. So the red one, be careful. Um, you must make sure that uh, uh, red means or pink means uh, something is very wrong. So there's a uh, possible whatever is it, or since this is a name of it, so I'll just remove, uh, ignore it, right? So like Papi, uh, Papa New Guinea, you know, um, this is definitely correct. So I'm just going to leave it. Like the black obsidian uh, stone is very good for your health. I uh, will just click this. Stones, uh, of course, stones. Um, the black obsidian stones be very good for health. Hmm. So probably this some some error are uh, very good for your health. Yeah. Um, simple English, easy to use, and it's very powerful. So of course you can uh, play around with more tools here. Uh, another tool that I like, one of them is also article writer and also the paraphrasing tool. Both of them I see is quite similar. Uh, if you want to, um, for example, uh, take a snippet of uh, another person's article and you just want to paraphrase it or just to rewrite it, you can use this. But I strongly don't suggest you using this tool 
simply because um, the grammar will be very out, even though you can double check with a grammar check tool, but um, I don't think it's um, good. Yeah, Make sure that always write good articles, good content. Uh, there's no point taking other people's content and you know just rewording it because then Google will know that you're not adding more value to the internet. All the best, guys.